Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. My name is Rebecca. It is winter. It's very chilly. It's been chilly for quite some time. And so today I thought we would just thrift for winter things. So I'm thinking we're gonna check out the knits and the cardigans and the jeans and the knit dresses and the boots. I am very excited. I feel really good today. I feel like we're gonna have a good haul. I don't know, I just feel it. So let's go inside. Something I kind of like about this. I love the zippers on sweaters. I just think it's the cutest thing. Totally getting this. I love this little vintage page sweater, but I feel like the color's not good for me. This is not at all winter themed. I was just looking at like the intimates while I was looking at the sweaters. Um, and I feel like this would be really cute like as a beach cover up. Okay, I'm going back to the sweaters. This is so cute. I don't need it, so I'm not gonna get it, but I love it. I still so badly want to find a vintage silk robe. Ooh, okay, that's not the one, it's medium, and I don't like the pattern. <laughs> I really dig this white one, but it's not silk, and so I'm just gonna hold out for like a silk one. But wait, I think it matches that dress I just picked up. It totally does, so the same brand. I just got to the vests, and I think this is adorable. While I'm here, I'm gonna look at the blazers. I don't love that blazer I got last time, like the colorful one, so I'm gonna try to find something that's more neutral. I don't know why, but I really like this. After a quick scan of the skirts, this is the only one that I kind of like. Um, I'm still not sure about it though, I need to go to a mirror. Holy cow, look at this leather coat. I love these stripes and the fit. It's so good. I am in the light jackets and I would like to find a bomber jacket. Double zipper. So there's this puffer bomber jacket, but it's not really what I'm looking for. While I'm in the jackets, I want to look at the vintage bath towels. I want to sew with like a vintage bath towel and make like a coat. My problem is, I don't really know how to ID vintage bath towels. This is a project for another day. In the jeans, looking for high rise, low rise, mid rise, anything loose at the bottom. We'll see. I think they're vintage off more, off more. I'm not sure. No luck so far. I don't know what this is made out of, so I'm not gonna get it. Are these clog crocs? <laughs> cool. Okay, I found a $5 mat nap bag, which is very exciting to me. An appointment very soon so I have to make some serious decisions and run and then we'll do our try on haul. I don't need it especially if I'm getting that leather jacket. <laughs> So we are back now. I have everything right there. Again, I was trying to thrift for winter things. Some of them are related to winter, some of them are not. So let's just get into it and I'll show you guys everything I got. This first item is this brown knit sweater. I got it because I love this shade of brown and I also loved the dual zipper. I think that looks so cool. I think it looks really nice because it just adds some extra shape to like a regular kind of knit. I also just think that the brown knit looks like really good quality. It's nice and heavy, it's nice and soft. Brand is C. 
KYC. I think this would be really cute with like a mini skirt and some high boots. It can really be dressed up or down, so I think it has a lot of potential in any like winter outfits. The next item I got is probably one of the things I'm most excited about. It is this biker jacket. I took a really, really long break from like thrifting leather jackets, but I found this and I just really couldn't pass it up. It is a really perfect fit on me. I love these lines right here in the front and the back, and I feel like it adds so much interest. The brand is Anne Klein, and I just love everything about it. I love this little clasp here in the front. It just looks so cool, and biker jackets are also something that's kind of trending right now. I would probably layer it with like another wool jacket on top on colder days. I do have a leather skirt that might look cool with it, or I'll just wear it with jeans or some black trousers. The next item I kind of found on accident, so I was looking in the sweaters, and then I went over just to like the intimate section just to kind of see what was there, because sometimes you can find some really cute things. First, I found this cute little nightgown. It has this little flower print on it, and then it's got like see-through mesh up here. A tie up back. Oh, it also has a slit in the very back, which I didn't notice at first, but I see now. If I wanted to wear it in the winter, I was thinking layer a sweater over top of it. I don't know though, maybe it looks too much like a nightgown to really wear out. And then after that, I was looking in the robe section, and I've always wanted like a vintage silk robe. And this isn't silk, but I had to get it because it was the matching robe to that gown. I'll just probably use this as a regular robe. Robe. I doubt that I'll really wear it out and about, but it is really pretty, so it's also just a cute little piece to have. Next item I got is something I've been looking for for so long, and I finally found it. They are these cowboy boots. I love them. They're like a green color with this, like, I think blue blackish stitching. They do have a heel. There's virtually no information about these. I don't see a brand anywhere. They're obviously 100% leather. I don't really know where they're from or how old they are. I think they'd be cute with midi skirts midi dresses. Um, I think they'd be cute with almost like a capri pair of pants. That would be adorable just to show them off and like how pretty this detailing is. I also think this green color is really unique so it's kind of exciting to have something like a little different. They won't be like the warmest on the bottom but they're boots so definitely winter. And the last item I got is this Matt and Nat bag. I love the color of this. It's like this purpley pink kind of. It's in really good shape. The outside doesn't have like any marks on it and the inside lining looks really great. The only thing is I need to just reinforce the stitching on this strap because it was coming apart and I'm sure that's why it was a little bit cheaper. I have been wanting bigger bags like this. Number one for functionality just because I need a lot more space and number two bigger bags are just trendier right now. I feel like it's nicer to have bigger bags in the winter to like keep your scarves and your mitts and your toques and everything extra that you'll need in here to keep warm. Um, maybe I'm stretching the winter theme a little bit, but I think it works. So anyways, that was all I got today. I hope you guys liked it. Let me know what your favorite piece was down in the comments below. If I had to choose a favorite piece, I think it would have to be the leather jacket or the cowboy boots. I'm very between those. Let me know what you like in the comments below. If you like this video, leave a like. And if you want to see more of my videos, do subscribe. I hope you guys have a great rest of your week and I'll see you next time. Bye.